Hey guys, this is Samjivit with another tutorial whether how we can apply discount to customer payments and receipts in QuickBooks desktop. Well, before applying discounts to customer payments and receipts, we need to set up discount account and subtotal so that we can apply it correctly. So go to items and services list to see whether we already have a discount account or not. And search discount here in this field. And here you can see that after searching, nothing showed up. It means no discount account has been set up so far. So to set up one, click on new under item. Here under the type field, select discount. You can name it whatever you want and write the description if there is a need. And also you can make it a sub account too. And here in this field, you have both the options either you can add your discount in terms of dollar amount or in terms of percentage. Remember, if you put it as a percentage, you have to add the percentage sign too. Anyhow, here you need to assign an account to it so that QuickBooks can track it properly. If you already have one, just select it. And if you don't, click on add new and create one. Well, you can create and assign either an income or expense account to it. If you create an income account, it will track it as a negative value and will show its impact under gross profit. And if you create an expense account, it will track it as a positive value and will show its impact under net profit. So it's really a matter of choice how you want to track it. And in this tutorial, I'm creating it as an income account to assign and track it. And here you can see that the discount account has been created and assigned. And then click on OK. Now let's set up subtotal. So go to items and services list and search subtotal. And here you can see that it showed up which means we already have created it in our previous tutorial and I will give its link in the description where you will be able to see how it's set up and applied. Now let's apply discount while receiving payments. So create another invoice and remove the terms if show up. And then click on save and close to record the invoice. Now go to the receive payment and select your customer. Here go to discount and credit after selecting the invoice you are receiving your payment against. It. And then write your discount in terms of fixed dollar amount. And then click on done after assigning your discount account. And here you can see that the discount has been applied to this payment. And then click on save and close to record the payment. Now let's apply customer discount to sales receipts. So go to create sales receipts and select your customer. And add some items and subtotal. And here you can see that we don't have discount and credit option here. So add your discount as a line item. Which you sure can override if you want. And then record it by clicking on save and close after making some changes according to your needs. And this is how you can apply discount to customer payments and receipts in QuickBooks Desktop. And if you have stayed this far, please consider supporting by liking, subscribing and sharing your thoughts in the comment section. And I hope this will be helpful for someone out there. And thanks for watching.